In this video, we will explore Travify's different supplier imports. This is one of the most powerful options with Travify because Travify offers over 100 different suppliers that you can access when building itineraries or proposals. So I'm gonna show you how this works. I'm in a new trip and I'm gonna start off by adding a new event by clicking the blue button that says new event. From this dropdown, you will see cruise the tour option and booking. I'm gonna go through each of these three. Now, if you ever wanna add a cruise, all you wanna do is choose the cruise option. Now from here, you can search Travify's database to find the cruise you want. Now, Travify supports all the major ocean and river cruise lines right in here. So you can start off by going ahead and selecting the cruise line. I'm going to do Royal Caribbean and then I'm going to find the cruise ship. So you'll be able to see all the cruise ships available and I want Brilliance of the Seas. So I'm going to select that. Now here's the itinerary. So I'm going to click get itinerary and it's going to show me everything that it's going to import into this trip. So I'm going to go ahead and say add to itinerary. And there it is. You can see that it just added all of the days. It added information on when it's arriving, departing, each destination in here. Now, of course, what's great about this is you do get a lot of information. You have things like photos, information, deck plans. And if you ever need to add any additional info, all you have to do is just click that pencil icon to edit and you can come in and include more information or add anything else that you wish to include for your clients. Now, when it comes to tours, we also have a database of tours that you can look up similar to how I added a cruise. What you'll do first is you want to go into the day that you want to add that tour, and then you're going to choose the new event button once again. That drop down menu is going to appear, and now we're going to select tour. Now, in here, we can see a drop down menu of all the tour lines available. Now, these are going to be your scheduled and preset itineraries. So these are not going to be custom itineraries, but you'll be able to find them in here. And then all you'll do is select the tour line. And then again, you just want to go ahead and find the tour, click get itinerary. You can see this trip that I'm going to pull in right now. I'm going to say add to itinerary and look at all the information. It brings in, you know, maps, photos, information the provider. And then again, you can come in and you're able to customize and edit all of this. Now that's a database of, you know, bookings of cruises and tours that you can just go ahead and look up. So that way it doesn't have to be, you know, looked by a confirmation number or booking or reservation number. But we do work directly with some suppliers and I'm going to show you how that works. To access this, you're gonna click new event, choose booking. Now, what this is, is this again, is going to be the ones that we've directly built an integration with. We've built an integration with many different suppliers that you can see here. And this allows you to input your client's booking information directly into any itinerary. Now you can see here, as I'm scrolling through, the suppliers we're currently working with. And they're very easy to use. All you'll want to do is choose the option or the booking that you want to pull in. Sometimes you will need to go ahead and log in so that way we can connect with your account. And then you'll just be able to put the booking number in, click get booking, and then it'll bring it all in for you. Now, if there's any suppliers that you do not see listed that you're typically using, definitely let us know. You can let us know right here. Just click let us know. We really want to know. We want to add all the suppliers that you're using. Um, so keep us updated. And thank you so much for watching and make sure to check out more of our getting started videos.